Hello, welcome back to the third, if I'm not mistaken, video of the Acer series, Acer Aspire. Um, so I haven't really modified anything, I only installed Google Chrome and the Camtasia Studio 7, which I'm recording with right now. And straight from the desktop, all you see is these shortcuts. The uh, mistake that people make is just delete these shortcuts, which... I would not recommend because the files are still there so what you can do is you go into computer and on the top here it says uninstall or change a program and once you click that you uh, you just give it about a minute or two and it loads up all the uh, all the programs you have installed upon uh, installation of Windows 7 you shouldn't have any of these so all these uh, Acer things I'm probably just gonna leave the Acer games I can install Uninstall um, has all these games. Please select one or more. Oh my god, let's just select everything. Has all these um, flash games installed. I know they're not really flash games, but that's what they're worth to me. You could just go play them online. I'm done clicking all these games. And uh, my voice is being recorded by the uh, by the computer microphone so we'll see how that turns out if it's actually good at picking up sound some programs take longer than others to uninstall because uh, they take up more space you know it's literally uninstalling one by one when it could just uninstall that folder and it's slowing me down a bit because of the uninstallation now you see a uh, flash pair a flash player 10 is installed um let's see cyberlink power dvd 9 that's probably like a burning software bing bar and i opened internet explorer which had uh, already about four different toolbars on the top which i hate when i go over to someone's house to uh, service their computer to fix their computer or anything and they have like 17 different toolbars it's really annoying, covers like half the screen. Right, I just won't touch the mouse until that's finished. Usually these, these uninstallations shouldn't take that long. But when they do, you just have to patiently wait for them. Um, I would pause the video, but I'm not sure what the hotkey on the on the computer is to do that. So we're just gonna have to wait. So I'll just close this because I'm a rebel. Okay, no, it's not gonna work. It's set on installing that. Right, let's go through this list. eBay Worldwide, Identity Card, a Launch Manager, McAfee, that's one thing that I have to uninstall. That's not bloatware, but it will slow down your RAM, your CPU, things like that, because it's, well, I don't know, I just, I might be wrong, it's just that's what I believe, and I don't really like McAfee or Kaspersky or Norton. Things like that. It has all the C++ redistributable installed, which I like. I'm gonna have to go through all that to install those. Nook for PC. Oh, that's the book program. Okay, so that is complete, and the icon disappeared, and it's faster already. All right, so McAfee, where are you? I'm gonna install McAfee and install. Avast, which is my favorite antivirus browser tools, everything. Remove. Warning. All right, whatever. Remove. In process. Removing that. Please check your status so you can adjust any security issues. Check status. Oh no. Or turn you off. Just un uninstall. Finish that up. Then the next thing I'm going to be uninstalling is, actually I'll finish with that later, I'm going to open up Chrome, 
and download my antivirus which you can download by typing in Avast free into Google it is a uh, there is a free version of their program it is a personal free version so okay let's Google user content okay now you just download the free one here free antivirus it has anything I would need um, Windows 7 has a good firewall so I don't need to download a separate firewall no thanks I want free protection Uh, it's only 53 megabytes, so that shouldn't take too long. Um, another thing I will uh, add on to this so-called series is gameplay videos, not really of uh, to see how I play, but how it plays with the computer without any modifications, without any hardware changes, which I might make in the future to get some more RAM, maybe a different processor. Now one thing I do notice about this computer is it's very quiet. It doesn't, uh, the fan doesn't make noise at all. And another thing is the uh, touchpad has gestures or gestures, no, yeah, it's gestures. So just like similar to the uh, to Apple computers, if you put two fingers down and scroll down, it actually scrolls down. As you can see it's pretty fast I'm not used to it but if you pinch things like that it does just what the Apple computers do which if you're switching from an Apple computer to this computer is very useful thank you your information was successfully transferred please remember you have your SMID every time it I don't know what that is but I don't care software removed okay I have to restart I'll just restart after I install the other one. So while that's downloading, I'll just uninstall some of the uh, the bloatware like the Bing Bar. In the future, do not show me this dialogue. So apparently, whoever set this computer up started on the 25th of April of this year. It all takes so long. That's why when I um I was actually thinking about doing it to this laptop to install a fresh copy of Windows 7 so that I don't have to go through all this. But I actually wanted to experience it and record it and show it to you guys and how you can avoid it. Let's see, I do not want to participate in that. Just follow the on screen guide to install Avast. Um People say it is pretty annoying because every day there's this Avast has been updated, things like that. But you can set the uh, the, the antivirus to gaming mode, is what it's called, silent slash gaming mode. And it nothing pops up, nothing, uh, nobody says anything, it just stays in this little corner and protects your computer silently. Which is very useful. What was I doing? Uh, what was it? Oh, okay, it's uninstalled. eBay Worldwide. I do not need that. What else? What else? Okay, so that's finishing up. Identity Card Launch Manager. Nook for PC. Norton. Online Backup. Let's see. Alright, the rest is just the programs they want you to use, like the uh, Times Reader, the uh, Norton Online thing. Nothing that will really get in my way, like the McAfee did. So it's doing a quick scan of my system. I'm gonna close out of that, minimize out of Chrome, and I'm gonna check out the uh, Task Manager, see what's in my process already. It's already full. Look at that. Uh, let's see, test manager test tools. Just make that full screen so I can see everything. Let's see, Google Chrome, Camtasia, Acer, 
backup manager. Is that still recording? Yes, it is. And I'm up to 10 minutes, which is just perfect because I'm about to stop the video anyway. We'll close out of that. Installation was completed. Thank you for participating. Whoa, thank you. And registration is free. You just have to register as a free one. You just have to give them your email and your name. What is my title? There's no awesome as a title. I'm gonna pick my state. Let us know how likely it is you would recommend a best so far. Ten. It's my favorite. I love it. Now, okay, what is this? Can I skip this? Yes. Okay, so now they're trying to push this into you, which I haven't seen before. It's something new. Now it's registered, now it's not going to be reminding me. And uh, if you right click on this, you can see silent slash gaming mode, which I will turn on, and it's not going to it's not going to bother me. It's not going to be saying anything. Now, another thing that I do with my computer is I kind of give it a classic XP look, like use small icons. I think that's it, yes. And uh, never combine. Yes, yes. And that is how I do it. So I can see the words, I can see what it looks like. And I'm just going to unpin all these different things I'd never use and I will what you're not supposed to do that why aren't you silent somehow turned off I will it updates constantly which is very good for an antivirus so if any new viruses come out on the market you will be protected so I will uh, delete all these programs and install some of my uh, important utilities and um, if I have more ideas on what to record I will upload them be sure to subscribe and wait for those other videos thanks for watching